Hey everyone, this is Jesse. I wanted to give some quick information about the giveaway. My goal is to get 100 subscribers. So all you have to do to join in the giveaway is like the video, throw a comment down on the bottom. I want to know who your favorite Pokemon is. And you have to subscribe to the channel. That's it. Nothing really to it. Once my channel has hit 100 subscribers, then I will be announcing who has won the giveaway. How I will go about picking the winner is once you drop a comment, I will issue a number. And then I will do a random generator to see who wins. No, no cheating or nothing. It's simple randomness. So please let me know what you think about this and join the giveaway. I want as many people as possible. I might even do one at 250 members. Stay tuned to find out. Now, please enjoy my first official box opening. Hey everyone, welcome back to the card shed. It's Jesse here to bring you something really great today. Finally got my hands on a booster box of the Rising Guardians Rising, excuse me. I'm super excited about it. I've been wanting to get one of these ever since it released, actually before, but I couldn't quite get to a pre-release, so I had to get it. I'm opening this bad boy up. We're going to get that double colorless energy today. It's going to be awesome. Pop this up here. Now these, I have opened maybe 10 packs all together. So I'm going to go through the first couple of packs. I'm going to name them off and see what I can actually get out of them. Oh, come on. All right. I got no clue how the rotation is going to go on this one, so... Yeah. There's your code. All right. So I land it. Well, you know, before I start, I think it's the same as the other one, so I'm going to do that real quick. All right. So I land it. Murkrow. Snow Runt. I've seen those a couple times. Pat Rat. Glider. And there's an energy. Suda Wudo. He looks pretty good. Field blower. That's actually going to be really useful in this new set. Choice band. That one's getting a lot of attention right now. And then a watchdog reverse hollow. And a turtonator. He looks awesome. I just, I, I think he looks great right now. It's kind of nice. I just wish it was a GX or a full art. But hey, the box is just getting started. 30. Four more packs after this one, so we're gonna get the ball rolling. All right, one, two, three, four. Now this set is awesome. I pulled maybe 10 packs open so far, so I've gotten a Metagross GX and a Ninetale so far, but that's all that I've seen. I haven't seen any of the good cards. All right, so there, Psychic Energy, the Nilish. Aqua patch those. I'm going to use those like crazy. Energy Lotto. Verse Hollow Murkrow. And ooh. A rare hollow drampa. That looks so cool, little Chinese dragon. Alright. Third pack. Got the drampa so far. Now I haven't heard. I could be mistaken completely. But are these boxes actually mapped out? Let me know if you think they are or not, because the Sun and Moon base set, when it first released, these booster boxes were mapped like crazy. Cast one. I'm glad they brought him back. He's not very good or anything, but he was just a, a good idea for a Pokemon. The Nose Pass, Deli Bird, Rock Ruff, Dark Energy, Max Potions. Very good for a Lunala run. Tentacruel. Haven't seen him yet. Lampant, Reverse Hollow Probopass, and Oricorio, is that how you say that? All I know is from Sun and Moon Games, she's got four different colors, it's pretty cool. Okay, so this might be a good pack. I know the Tapu Lele right now, she, she's getting a lot of attention, so I got to get me some of those. 
Oh, that, that's a cute one. I should have went with that nine tails I had, but I got rid of it. Pancho. Gothia. Gothita. Excuse me, I forgot the T. Marini. I want a Toxapex so bad. I got to build me a Toxapex deck. Aloma Mola. Enhanced Hammer. Reverse Hollow. Energy Recycler. And. Ooh, Requaza. He might not be a holler or anything, but he is one of my favorites by far, so I'm glad to get that at least. I can rock his night form. That just looks insane. I never really played him on Sun and Moon, but still thought it was a good idea. I know I revert back to Sun and Moon a lot, but it's the game I picked back up after playing Emerald, so I was out for a while there. Jang Mo. Oh. He was cool. Trubbish. Everybody's gonna have Garbodors, I think. Whammer. Tello. Another energy. Slow bro. They tried to give him an EX, but I still just do not think he's all that great. That's just my opinion, apparently. A choke. Oh, reverse hello Goomy. The crochet looks nice. His effects are good. And uh, regular Probo Pass. Oh well. Still got plenty more here. I do like the low in forms. They look cool. Sand slash is pretty cool looking one. Alright, Sand Shrew. Mudbray. Well, let's see, there's another low and Geodude. I don't like his idea of electric, though. Most rocks just kind of ground out electric. It makes no sense to me. Chop. Trebish. Energy. Multi switch. Sableye. Fletchendire. Ooh. Reverse hollow Absol. And. Oh, well, there's a Sand Slash. It's a regular one, but hey, it's still a Sand Slash. All right, I gotta get a good pull here. I gotta see a new GX. Got to be something there. Come on. All right, I want to see a full art, hyper rare something. Rock rough, Clefairy, Vanillaite, Wishy Washy. See, I was disappointed in the first set because he didn't have his GX, and he, he he's a powerhouse in the game if you do him right. It's pretty cool. Give me. Energy. Rescue stretcher. I haven't seen that. That could be useful. Kamala. Well, koala won't sleep all day. Gotharita. Gotharita. It's gotta be right. And ooh, there's a reverse hollow stretcher. And oh there you go. Got the wishy washy. Uh, he just looks awesome. I know it's just a bunch of fish busted together, but I think he's just a great concept. I'm gonna put that little bad boy in the sleeve real quick. First GX pull. Let's see if I can't stand it up back here. There we go. All right, it's a good start. They're waiting on the full art, so they look all great. I pulled so many hyper rares from the first set. I want to see another one. I want to see a Tapu Lele. That's one that nobody can get, it seems. Snow Runt. Pat Rat. Glider. Bellsprout. Cottony. Dark Energy. Whimsy Cot. Beware. They at least gave him a rework. Sligoo. Gotharita. Reverse Hollow Gotharita. And uh, Oricario. And the fire form. All right. I'm gonna start flying through these packs a little bit. Yeah, I've seen most of these cards probably. All right. Um, Petalil, Fleshling, Kyodu, Barboach, and then Brooklet Hill. It's a good little stadium in the new one. Beware again. Uh, I still can't say her name. Aloha Mo Mola. Sound right. Machop Reverse Hollow. And Victory Bell. 
that pollen hazard though it just looks insane burned confused and poisoned that's that's just crazy it's a lot of different status conditions in the game let me know what y'all think has been the best ones from this new set because i have not seen a lot of them and i really want to so drop a comment below and just let me know what you think about it any of the smaller ones you're going to build as a fun deck i don't know i'm just waiting on tox effects that's what i really want to build um, he seems cool 100 damage in between turns that's that's insane and with his other tox effects from sun and moon yeah it's, it's gonna do some damage Hakomo, oh, another Brooklyn Hill. Reverse Hollow, Pangaro, and a Talonflame. All right, I don't know how many packs have been through so far, but we got one GX, so it's not looking too good for the home team right now. Right, drop another code for you real quick. All right, let's see. Barboach, Clefairy, Tentacle, Beldum, go with that Metagross I got, Helioptile, it's a cool little design of a Pokemon, Hala, it's a great name, Hala, Alolan Graveler, Aether Paradise Conservation Area, that's a mouthful, but it might replace a giant, of, or forest of giant plants, excuse me, I don't know. It's the only grass stadium that's out right now. Reverse hollow energy, or yeah, reverse hollow energy lotto. That's a mouthful. And Oricario. Who knows? I might get all four colors. What am I missing now? Water, I think. Come on, y'all. Bless these pools. I gotta get something going. Hello, Nose Pass, Salanda, I want to see the, I can't remember her name, Salanda, mate, no, that evolved form, you know what I'm trying to say, Murkrow, Vanillite, Dark Energy, another Max Potion, another Energy Recycler, Gotharita, and Reverse Hollow Talonflame, that looks pretty good, and then, Heliolus, Healy Olisk. That's the name. Looks cool. Reminds me of the uh, dinosaur from Jurassic Park at the end. Alright, let me see. Gotta get something. Wishy washy cannot be the only thing I get from this box. Hanchum. Gothita. Litwick. Fletchling. Carvana, still energy, altar of the moon, I bet there's an altar of the sun too, every video I've seen so far it has both of them in it, weeping bell, uh oh I was wrong, but that glare looks great, look at that, some good artwork, multi switch, reverse, oh another metacross, that looks great, I, I, metacross has just been a favorite ever since he come out, I don't know which one he got released on, but he is just, he looks great. And he always seems to be just a strong Pokemon. So, that, that's a good card. That was the one to go somewhere for me. All right. Delibird, Mudbray, Slowpoke, Gumi. Rock rough. Fighting energy. I'm a choke. Lamp pants. Clefable. Minior. This little guy's awesome. He seems so weak, but he, he just he, he he looks cool. And then oh yeah. The full art drampa. Look at that. That thing looks great. It's awesome. Put that bad boy in the sleeve too here. That just that dragon looks so cool. I don't know why. Uh, kind of reminds me of old grandpa. I guess that's why his name Grandpa though. Reminds me of the uh, flying dog off of the Neverending Story, I believe it was. It's 
That's pretty cool. All right. Another tentacle bell gun. Helioptile. Phantom. Excuse me. Snuffle. Steel energy. Kamala. What is this thing? Comatose. As long as active Pokemon. Whenever you attach an energy, it is now asleep. Oh, I guess it has to be asleep. That's weird. Me tang. Got the whole line for the Metagross now. Pseudo Wudo. Reverse Hollow Barboach. And uh, Mudsdale. Carlos Grill. I don't know how strong it'll be if it'll get any play time, but it does look good. I'm just happy I finally got me a trainer box. This is only like the third one I've ever opened up. So, pretty stoked about this. I'm trying to get master sets of them all too, so I might actually start here. Low and Sanctuary. Mud Bray for the mud, mud stuff I got. Yeah, dude. Just need the gold one for him. Me time. Clefable. Gliscor. Is that how you say that? Gliscor. Okay. Your opponent's active Pokemon has no damage counters on it before this attack. Huh. Vanillux. Reverse Hollow. And Wishcash. It's a weird looking Pokemon. Stays in the water. It's a water Pokemon, but it's always ground type or something else, apparently. Alright. One, two, three, four. Did they have a Waylord in this set, too? I don't know. I keep seeing Waymore, so I would assume they did. Wimpod. I gotta get a Glissapod, too. He's just, he looks so cool. He looks like an alien mix. Wishy washy. Rescue, Stretcher, Watchdog, Slowbro, Gothita, and, ooh, Lycanroc GX. Man, that looks awesome. Reminds me of all the uh, werewolves, which I know is supposed to look like that, obviously, but it's just so cool. All right. Chop, Travis, Pet Lil, Chansey, Vulpix, Energy, Hakomo, O, Sun, Mallow, Reverse Hollow, Slowbro. There's the Waylord. Looks so weird. It's good art though. It looks kind of nice. Alright. I'll start going through these a little bit quicker. Long ways to go still, seems. So yeah, just let me know what you think about all these new cards. I'd love to have a little discussion with you. It ain't no biggie. That's one I never actually got in Sun and Moon. I should have. He was easy to get. I just never got him. Oh, there's the reverse for Quaza. He looks awesome. He always has. And then Salazel. That's her name. Salazel. When you play this Pokemon from you to evolve your one of your Pokemon during your turn, you may leave your opponent's active Pokemon burned and poisoned. Okay. It's not too shabby. Gotta say. Burns, I think they changed it up a little bit in TCG. I think it's like two damage counters now or something. A little different, huh? Not too bad. I don't get the difference between that and just a bad poison. Maybe y'all can help me understand that one. Carvana, Tello, Jangmo, or Deli Bird. Energy, Whimsy Card. The wages of fluff. If the defending Pokemon is knocked out during your next turn, take two more surprise cards. Just imagine if you could set him up. You could kill one of your opponent's Pokemon and take 
four prize cards if you do it right. Max Potion Reverse and Chandelure Rare. That looks awesome. Chandelure is just a, a weird Pokemon. It's literally a chandelier that they brought to life. So, what do I know though? Some of these concepts for Pokemon is just baffle me. But I got those four good ones back here, so it's not too bad. Next one. Next one. Vanillish. There's another Aqua Patch. I'm needing the really bad. Oh, reverse Mudge, though. Looks pretty good. And Tango Road. I never played with the dark ones too much. I probably should. They seem like they do a lot of things. They have a lot more hand mess. They, they mess with the opponent's hands, it seems a lot. Especially Absol. She's got them all over the place. So, I don't know. I got to look into that. Still a cute one. Lowland Vulpix. They just made everything on her a lot more curly and blue. Looks pretty good. Nether Paradise Conservation. Holla! Marini. Reverse Graveler. And Oricario. Need the blue one. I think it'd be really cool to get off four to this one box. Alright. Drop another code for you. Let me know if y'all are using these too, because it just, it really helps me keep up with what I have and don't have. I do sell these online, so if you want to pick up a couple extra codes, leave me a message and I, I will have some for you, especially Guardians Rising right now. Gumi, Rockra, Tello, Nosepass, Salandit, and Fighting Energy, Marini, Aloma Mola, names, that's, it's going to always baffle me, Enhanced Hammer. And then the Reverse Hollow Trubbish. Oh, Turtonator GX. I did get the one that looks a lot better, apparently. I don't know why. He, did. he just looks like a, a angry dragon turtle. It's pretty cool. The spikes on his back and blow everything up. All right, so that's five pulls so far. I gotta get another full art. I gotta get a secret rare. That's what I really need. Gotta get that secret. A rare candy would be great, but that double colorless would just set it off. Stuff, tentacle, helioptile, pet little chancy. It's all the commons. Graveler, mallow, tentacruel, reverse waylord. And Hon Honkrow, how do you say that? I personally think Murkrow looks better. It follows the um, form a lot better. Sinister looking bird. I don't think they made Honkrow too fat or something. Alright, I'm getting all the way down. There's got to be one more good card in here at least. Changma, Wishy Washy, Deli Bird, Mudbray, Slowpoke, Energies, Switch, Multi Switch, Sableye, Fletchender, Nose Pass, Reverse, and Gotha Tell? Is that how you say that? She looks pretty cool. Not a hollow or anything, but hey, can't all be winners, can they? Yeah, dude, I still want to see the golem. I know he's in here. I, I, I want to see a, a Lolan golem card, too. Yeah, dude, glider, bell scrub, cotton, and sand shrew. Energy, gliss core, altar of the moon. And these have shown me up because I watch so many pack openings and it's always all. Oh, there you go. Okay. Now I'm talking different again. Sun and sun and moon. There you go. Ha Hakamo'o. Reverse. And a Lunala. Uh, they gave her a different card. So. 
She might be different. It's not quite as energy pull as the big one. It might work out because she needs a lot of energy to be good with her GX. I got to get a Sylvia on. That would make certain people in this house very happy. Wimp pod. Energy. Wimpsy cats. Now beware. Sleepy. Uh, reverse mud bray and sharpedo. Don't seem very good for a uh, rare in a stage one. It's got one move that does 70. So, it's kind of weak. Especially to have a mega sharpedo out there floating in the EX world. It's like it could be better. Pet Rat, Carvana, Cottony, Bell Sprout, and Panchon. Energy Hakamo. Oh, Reverse Stretcher. Pseudo Wudo. That's just a fun name to say. Little fighting tree wants to imitate things. And Matchamp. Reverse. Oricario. That's, what, five Oricarios now? Good little bird, I guess. Dropping cards everywhere. All right, Django, Deliver, Travis, Machop, Rockruff, Energy, Field Blow. Might have to play those just to blow stadiums off. Hakomo O again. Brooklet Hill. Reverse Marini. Those are pretty cards. Weird looking Pokemon though. And. So Galio. Well, I got both of their other cards. I think it's weird how they're spelling sun and moon in these cards. I didn't know moon had an E and sun had two N's and an E and I guess to give it pizzazz. Alright, that way, the fairy, tentacle, cash, gothita, energy. Glow. That's, that's some good artwork, I gotta tell you. Choke. Energy Lotto. Reverse Slowpoke. And a Comfy. That looks good, but I'm not a very good fairy person, I guess you could say. Alright, I gotta get another full art. I'm down to my last five packs here. Six, maybe. Alright. Last code. Let me know if y'all get anything good off of those. I want to see if they actually get good pulls. I don't play online, so they do me no good whatsoever. Chop, Phantom, Barboach, Carvana, Tello, Fairy Energy, Max Potion, Energy Recycler, Gotharita, Reverse Sharpedo, and Swellow. Such a weird name. That come out in second or third generation now? Back when I was playing Emerald. Still one of the best ones, I believe. Alright, stuff with Selene, Mudbrick, Velonite, Glider, Fighting, Komala. This is a cute Pokemon. Multi switch, a watchdog. I didn't even know that was a Pokemon. Glider reverse, and a Vanillux. Not bad. All right, yep. Four more packs. Come on, Tapu Coco. Give me some. Had a little chancy, Gothita, Vulpix, Fleshling, Energy, Machoke, Lampin, Clefable, Reverse Sligu, and a Garbodor. That trash lunch. I think it might do something because people play a lot of items. Just gotta find a way to get around the Vulpix. 
because she will shut it down. She might tell me. Thought about building her up. Everybody I've talked to online says I need to put Vulpix in my Lorantis deck. I personally don't really want to, but you know. Right, Gumi, Wimpug, Nosepass, Wishy Washy, and Slowpoke. Energy, Fletchender, Weeping Bell, Enhanced Hammer, Jangmo O, Tapu Coco GX. Well, I did get the Tapu. Look at that. That's, that's a, I, I think he looks the best out of all of them. It's not bad. He looks cool, but he's not exactly the most useful, I guess you could say. Alright, two more packs. I've got to get something else. Which those, I guess, aren't too bad of pulls for a box, but can always be better. Reverse Stretcher, Watch the Hole, Slowbro, Reverse Honkro, and ooh, a Rare Absol. I think the Rares personally look a lot better than the Reverse. Look at the top four cards of each player's deck and put them back in any order. See? Always got to mess with you. Alright, last pack. There's got to be a Secret Rare in here. Got to. Can't come up on all secrets empty. Maybe a hyper rare, at least something's got to come out of it. All right, Trebish, a chop, a rock roof, Beldum, a Welmer, energy. A Loma Mola, Beware, Sliggy, Reverse Hollow Choice Band, not bad, and Trevenant. Well, I got a Trevenant, but it's not a good card that I was hoping for. But I, I got all these two. It's not too bad pulls, I guess. 5GX is in a full art. So if you like what you saw today, please let me know. Drop a comment below. Tell me how I did. If you didn't like it, you can even do that. Help me get some feedback and let me know what I'm doing right and wrong. You can also purchase any of these and more if you would like off of my Facebook page or Instagram. I also have a, a TCGplayer.com account, but you can talk to me on Facebook and we'll figure it out from there if you would like. But I will have the links below. You can go there. We can talk. I can let you have them before I post them on TCG. You can get first dibs. I got codes. I got all kinds of stuff for you. But like it, share it, and subscribe if you have not already done so. Thank you and have a good day.